Okay, so yeah, this place is getting mean. Alright, just so no one says I didn't give it a shot. Uh, no pun intended. It looks like it could have its purposes. Okay. So, boss time, so saith the glowy blue door. That's a lot of bats. And that's a big bat. And that was not expected. Belore, huh? It's a heads with hand, uh, a head with hands, boss, huh? I have to know. Can I just severely cheese this? Okay, it looks like it doesn't quite have enough range for me to do that. That would have been pretty funny if I could have. Okay. Now this is gonna be a thing, it looks like. much having to sneak in what hits I can. The hands don't seem to have any health of their own, so I can't make them go away. I can just float there with Medusa Head to go after the eye for a bit if I want, but again, the hands don't want to stay out of the way. Kind of a cheap-seeming boss, really. I mean, seriously. How are you supposed to dodge all that? Come on! <sighs> yeah, we'll pretend that hit me. Oh gods, now what? Well... Medusa Head works pretty well now. Ballore packs a deadly punch. Seriously wondering if there was something to the first phase of that fight that I was just missing. I'm probably gonna keep a safe state around here in case anyone wants to fill me in on what I may have missed. Giant bat. Transforming into a bat gives you the ability to fly. I think that's what I need for some of those items I missed elsewhere. Oh, suddenly cutscene. Oh, hey, Jay. Oh. Jay, what's wrong? You look pale. Don't worry, just now, all of my memories came flooding back. What? 
It seems that your dark power triggered the return of my memories. Just like I guessed, I have quite an extensive history with Dracula. I thought so. My real name is Julius Belmont. I am a descendant of a clan that has fought against Dracula for ages. And the person who destroyed Dracula in 1999 was... Yes, it was me, but there were others who assisted me. So if Dracula is revived again, just as it's written in the prophecy, then I must destroy him. It is my destiny. You haven't met a man named Graham yet, have you? Graham? Oh, you mean that missionary, right? I met him a little while ago, but when he saw my face, he turned and ran. He told me that he was Dracula. I did sense Dracula's powers at work within him, but it's difficult to believe that he's Dracula. Rather, I think... No, forget it. It's nothing more than a hunch. Huh? Assuming that he is Dracula, I won't be able to kill him yet. Why not? I need my weapon. Your weapon? Yes, it's a whip that was handed down to me. It's called Vampire Killer. In 1999, I sealed it in this castle to weaken his spirit and magical powers. That means it's in this castle somewhere. Yes, and I know exactly where it is. I'll go and get it now. All right, please be careful. Pray that my hunch proves to be wrong. Farewell for now. Okay. So, a couple of souls to show there. Falcon Punch! Pretty short range, and against an enemy like the Killer Mantle, not all that effective. As for Giant Bat, we're a bat! We're tiny, and we can probably get into tight areas. And also some of those areas that I couldn't quite get to earlier. But for now, I think that's going to call it. We beat another boss, we've made some good progress, and we'll have plenty of areas to check out next time. So until then, thank you very much for watching. I hope you're enjoying the series so far. If anybody knows a better way to take on the first part of the Bellore fight, please let me know. And I shall see you again next time. Until then, fare thee well.